Thank you for watching. I'm, my name is Ed Samples. I'm with Electroarc Manufacturing. Today we're going to be troubleshooting a little bit with your machines and we're going to talk about if you've got no spark or spark with no disintegration. Of course one of the first things we want to do is make sure there's power to the machine. So make sure your circuit breaker is on and then we're just going to make sure we have a heat selected, selected and disintegration is on. Don't need head vibration on and we don't need coolant so just the disintegration. And what we're going to do, we're going to start testing um, our our table is our ground, so we're going to start from there. And what we want to do, we just want to make sure that we get some type of reading. Uh, we should be getting at least four volts um, at each point we check. So we're going to start from the table to the electrode. Make sure we've got power there. If we don't have power there, we're going to move up just a little bit and check at the spindle here. And again, if we don't have power there, we're going to move all the way to the top. And we're going to check right here with this power strap. And we want to check this side of it first. So we're going to check there and again if we don't have voltage there, move to the back of that strap. And we're going to check right here. Now we're checking at the end of the power coolant cable. So if we don't have voltage there, we want to follow this cable all the way down and back. Make sure we're checking here. So we're going to check right there at that brass fitting. And if we have power here, then we know that it's going to, the problem is going to stem from this power coolant cable. Now our cable is specially designed for our machines, so do not use a hydraulic hose and you cannot use any type of high pressure hose. Our hoses are specifically designed to carry current as well as the coolant. So that's the only hose we can use. So if you've got power down there, not up here, replace this hose. Make sure you're using one of our factory hoses. If we do have power here and not here, your ground strap could be the problem. So now this will be the next point to, re to replace. If we had power here and not down here, we want to check this. Make sure your collet and electrode are in good condition. Make sure they're clean, free of corrosion. If we have power through all that, we should be getting disintegration. If we are not, then the, part, the problem could lie with your part. Make sure it's not insulated from the table in any way, no wood, no rubber, uh, anything that could insulate it from, from uh, getting a connection. So that's our video on uh, having no spark. Uh, if you're still having issues, feel free to give us a call or watch one of our other uh, troubleshooting videos. Otherwise, if you're getting power through all that, you should be disintegrating.